What's up guys, smarthelping.com here. I found a nice tool to figure out if you're trying to find a value between certain date ranges with other tags. Um, also, it could, doesn't have to be between dates, it could be whatever criteria you have. Um, but this is really nice with Google Sheets if you're trying to um, find a value but you only wanna look between certain things. So this comes up a lot in all kinds of different uh, things where you have a data set with, usually it's with dates, but it could be something else. And you're only wanting to look at certain values and you don't want to like repopulate a list that it takes a bunch of helper columns and everything else. So what you can do is here, what if I wanted to find, if let's say I have a set of dates here, a set of values, and I want to find the max value only if the date if the value is between the start date and this end date or it could be like greater than this date or less than this date only or whatever so what you do is you just do a filter the filter formula is really nice usually you use it to just like okay i want to filter you know show all of this stuff if you know this you know equals red or something And you'll get let's do blue so we have multiple ones and you'll get a nice array here of all those values and now you can actually put that in a formula and do lookups and in, in, in different kinds of calculations only on these values while using the filter so you put the filter and then you wrap that around something else and you can use this structure to find things so in ours, we're not doing multiple columns. We're just doing one, um, a filter in one column. So like this would be filtering, you know, let's say A2, or let's say we only want to see column C. So we do a filter C. So it's giving us everything in C if the value is blue. So you can see four, four, 50, five, and two. Now if we change one of these to say green, now changes. So now we have this set here, but we can look up a value within this set. Let's say I want to find the min of that set. I just put min in front of the filter and it returns me the min of two. So it's looking up that filter, finding the min and just spitting that out. So there's all kinds of uses here. It's just a nice little tool. Um, I use it all the time. And so what we've, the actual example I used here, you can see I've found all the min value between these two dates which is two the max value between these two dates and then i've also added a third criteria where this actually finds the min value between these two dates and only if the color is blue and the max value between these two dates only if the color is blue so you can see here we have a blue that is 50 but this date is after this date so it doesn't count because we're only counted between these two dates um, with our formula. So that's just a nice thing. You can always filter out a data set and then do lookups if you're trying to find a specific value that meets certain criteria, um, but you only want to include certain um, data in this search. All right, this is just a free tool. I'll, I'll put the link in the uh, description box below, and I'll see you on the next one, smarthelping.com.